In markets like this one in Catania, where we spent time with another top Sicilian chef, Carmelo Chiaramonte, from the restaurant Il Cuciniere. Medicina popolare, diciamo, mediterranea, ed usato con i bastoncini di finocchietto. These are dried stalks of wild fennel, not just an aromatic flavoring, but widely used as a medicine, he says. Questo qui praticamente si mette, per esempio, le olive si si prendono con un ago, si bucano e si tengono in acqua tre giorni, si cambia l'acqua tutti i giorni, poi si passano in salamoia con una percentuale di sale del 7% e si mettono i rametti di finocchietto spezzati o anche interi e quindi queste durano due o tre mesi e poi si cominciano a mangiare le... anche il peperoncino e l'aglio servono a questo, per la capacità antisettica. Carmelo orders his fruits and vegetables, like his fish, directly from the market from suppliers who make sure he gets the best. And he knows the qualities of all this materia prima, as it's called in Italian. La stagione più misteriosa, soprattutto per la frutta, no? This is what Carmelo calls la stagione misteriosa, the mysterious season of fruits that mature when the weather turns cooler. In September, October, and November in Sicily, a whole series of fruits start to mature only when it's fresher apples and pears, but also pomegranates, sorb apples, arbutus berries, jujubes, chestnuts, walnuts. They have a very precise, late-season character. Here we have cauliflower from the plains, broccoli, also a selection of tomatoes. And this is strato, estrato di pomodoro, tomato extract, another deeply traditional product, also dried in the sun. It has all the deep, dark color of a Sicilian August and makes ordinary tomato paste look and taste like Campbell's cream of tomato soup. It has to be made in August, Carmelo says, because you can't risk the rain. 